Hey guys, what's up? This is Carmen Fan921 when it came out to do this. Um, I know um, I wasn't supposed to be making any more videos tonight, but um, I, while I was in bed, I was thinking to myself, you know, 2009 had so many awesome movies. 2009 just had tons and tons of movies that were so awesome. So I thought to myself, hey, why not make a list of top 10 favorite movies of 2009. So this is Carbon Fan number 21 and came out to Davis, and today I'm going to be counting my picks for my top 10 favorite movies of 2009. There was a lot of good movies that came out that I, I wish I could add more on the list. But, um, since I've seen more, uh, movies, um, some were from 2009, so, um, I'm gonna make my list, uh, right now. Okay, and of course, if you do not agree with anything on here, that's totally okay with me. I don't mind that at all. So, without further ado, let's get started on the list, shall we? Number 10, The Hangover. Alright. This movie was hilarious, alright? I really liked it. I watched it um, this year, I believe. And I have the movie on Blu-ray. I've seen it only one time. What I've seen of it, it was hilarious. I really enjoyed it. thought it was a really good movie. I definitely recommend it. It was funny. I thought it was entertaining, okay? I thought it was a good comedy to watch. Alright, I've heard um, there are two sequels of this, and what I heard from the two sequels they weren't really all that good but this one this one was just what more can i say okay this was an awesome movie and that's why um it's at number 10. number nine watchmen okay um i wasn't too sure about this movie but it had patrick wilson and patrick wilson's in my favorite movie why is seen about seeing it um I did actually enjoy it. The reason why it's lower on my list is because of the sex scenes. Okay, did not like the sex scenes, but it was still a good movie. I, I liked it. I liked the effects of the movie. I liked how the movie was directed and written. I thought the story was good. I thought everything about the movie was good. Okay, I really did enjoy it. Okay, so it's definitely a movie that I would recommend, um, although there is... It is a little weird, um, sometimes, but, um, I did like the movie. Okay, I really do, and, um, it's at my number nine spot, you guys. Number eight, Star Trek. Okay, this was an epic movie directed by J.J. Abrams. Okay, um, it was just an incredible movie. It had really good sci-fi, it had really good fantasy, it had really good action. I really liked it this movie a lot. I thought this was an intense movie. I do enjoy the sequel a little bit more, but this was still a really good movie. I thought the effects were done perfectly. I thought the script was written good. I just love this movie. This was just an intense action movie that I really recommend. It was really good, and I really do like J.J. Abrams' work. I really do. I really like this movie, and I would recommend it to you guys. Number seven, Michael Jackson's This Is It. This movie, oh my god, you guys, this is my favorite music documentary. This movie right here, all right, made me love Michael Jackson even more when I saw it. Okay, when I watched this movie, this was just a really good movie. I thought, I thought, you know, it was just this. Oh, what, what, what? There's, there's so much, there's so much good stuff about this movie that I'm thinking of reviewing the movie again. All right, this movie, this movie was just awesome. It was really entertaining. Okay, you know, to see Michael Jackson, to see Michael Jackson's final performance in, uh, in a movie. Okay, I really do miss him, even though he's been gone for six years. I, I still miss him. And let me just say, um, this movie just was really awesome. Really liked the music in it. Number six, 
Princess and the Frog, okay? Um, Princess and the Frog, okay, saw this in the movie theaters on New Year's Eve. Really enjoyed it, okay? And this movie was just really impressed me that, you know, Disney still has, still has the magic, okay? It really does. It actually bring, brought back, all right, you know, regular animation, like animation, like Aladdin and all that. It should have made more money at the box office. Um, sadly, it didn't, but let me just say, I'll always find this movie to be classic. A classic Disney movie. It had really good animation, really good story. It was just a really good movie, okay? A really good Disney movie, and I'm probably going to have to re-get this movie because my DVD keep, keeps on scrap, is scratch, it kept on skipping. Uh, I'll, I'll get it on Blu-ray when I can, but this, but let me just say, awesome movie, it's just awesome, uh-huh. Number five, Avatar. This movie was incredible, I mean, I thought I was going to think the movie was overrated like everybody else thinks that it is, but I really did like this movie, I really enjoyed it, okay? When I watched it in 3D, 3D looked it incredible, okay? This had my my brain blown, okay? This movie just really had incredible special effects. This was just a really, really good movie. One of James Cameron's best, in my opinion. But I just really thought that this was a really well done movie. I thought it was definitely really good. I thought it was definitely worth watching again. Um, I think some people might be surprised that this is at my number five. Well, personally, there is four more movies that I enjoyed more. Okay, but, um, don't worry. At least it's at the top five. Yay. Number four, District 9. Okay, this was just an incredible movie, okay? One of the best alien movies I've ever seen, okay? This was an intense movie, this was a fun movie, I really had a good time, CGI looked it real good. This was just a really good Alien movie, okay? It feels like Alien mixed with... Mixed with... I, I, I don't know, some, some mutant bug movie. But, uh, this, this movie, I really enjoyed it a lot, I really had a lot of fun with this movie, okay? Even though I've seen the movie like two two weeks ago, I think. But I still really liked it. I did think it was a really, really epic movie. And it was a real, real fun joy, rap, joy ride for me. I enjoyed every single bit of this movie. It had, a good act, it had good acting, good CGI effects. And a good story. So what do you have? A good movie at number four. Number three. Ponyo. Okay, this movie was just incredible. It had a really good story, alright? I know it copies the same plot as The Little Mermaid, but I actually did like this movie, okay? Not not the biggest fan of anime, but um, I do really like Studio Ghibli movies. I think Studio Ghibli movies are incredible, and this is one of my favorite ones that they've made, okay? Okay, this was just a really good movie. I really enjoyed it. Alright, this movie just... This this was just such an incredible movie. Alright, How, Hayao Miyazaki made a really good movie right here. This movie was just so good. I went and got it on Blu-ray. I had to get it. Because, really, it was just an incredible experience for me. I really thought it was that good, okay? And I'm excited for Spirited Away to come out on Blu-ray because I really do like that movie as well. As a matter of fact, it might be my favorite anime movie, but this movie is just really awesome and I really liked it a lot. Number two, Zombie Land. This was a funny movie, okay? This movie was just really, really, really awesome. One of my favorite zombie movies. This had awesome acting. This proved that the zombie genre isn't dead, okay? It proves that horror comedy 
horror and comedy still had it in them. And they added awesome actors and turned it into an awesome movie. Okay, and I do not think that this movie ripped off Shaun of the Dead at all. Because Shaun of the Dead still has people in it. I'm not saying Zombie Land. This movie does have people in them, but it's not, not, not that much. But still, this movie was awesome. I really liked it. It was so funny. It was so awesome. Okay, it's not extremely graphic, but there is gore in it, just um, not a lot as I, as I expected it to be. But it was still a really good movie. It's at number two. Number one, Up. This movie lifted me up. It lifted me up real high. And no, I didn't... Well, okay, but anyways, let me get back to it. This movie was awesome. Okay, this movie is an animated movie that got nominated for Best Picture, just like Beauty and the Beast. Okay, this is my favorite animated film of 2009 and it's my favorite movie of 2009 this movie was just awesome it was really really just it had a really good story with really good characters really good everything it was just really really good okay it, it has this it had really good animation it's one of the best pixar movies i've ever seen Okay, it had, it, it just had a lot of good stuff in it, and what, what more can I say? This had everything, this had everything that a Pixar movie needed, okay? It, it's just, it's just really good, okay? And I'm glad that, that, that this movie exists. I wish I could have seen it in the movie theaters to experience it. But, you know, since I have it on blue right now, it, it, that, that's still good enough. But still, this is my favorite movie of 2009. Highly recommend it. Definitely check it out. Okay, guys, that was my list for my top 10 favorite movies of 2009. I know it's not 2009 anymore. 2009 was six years ago. But, um... All I can say is there were just so many good movies in 2009 that um, I had to make a list, okay? 2009, I thought, was an awesome year for movies. I might even make a list for my top 10 favorite movies of 2013. And, uh, no, you guys, I'm not making a list for top 10 worst movies of 2009. Um, because, to be honest, I haven't even seen that much bad movies from 2009. So, that's probably going to take me a while. Even if I did make a list, um, I, I wouldn't do it, okay? But, let me just say, there were so many good animated movies from 2009 that, you know, I just didn't have enough on this list. Because there were so many other movies I enjoyed more. How many were on my list? Three animated movies were on this list. But anyways, this has been Carmen Fan 921 when you came out to you. If you want to give me a list of your top 10 favorite movies of 2009, comment down below if you would like. Or you can just tell me your favorite movie of 2009. Up to you. This is Carmen. Or you don't have to if you like. If you don't want to. This has been Carmen Fan 921 when you came out to you. Hope you guys enjoyed. Promise no more videos tonight. See you guys later. Word out. I mean, this starts out. You know, normal, there's nothing violent or anything like that, but later on, there's some 